Trash alert! <laughs> Recycling alert! Beep, 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 beep! And we got an orange, alright.
like if you had a pizza box and half of it was greasy and cheesy, you'd rip it in half and recycle it back. Why it messes up the stuff if it's greasy? Yeah, the grease kind of messes why, up the mold? Sorry? Mold or why? Um, I think it's just because the grease and the water don't mix well and so they add water to the paper fibers and then if you add grease, then it messes it up somehow. Mm. Hi. Hi. We have a usable uh, medicine cabinet that our neighbors have talked at and we're trying not to have it go to the back. So I'm having a heck of a time figuring out where to put it. You do, um, I mean, there's so many websites out there that give fun, creative ideas about how to reuse other stuff. Oh, really? Sometimes. I, like, I'm, I'm, I'm subscribed on some email thing where I get it every day. It's like, it's called Home Talk. And it scans like, oh, this is what you can do with your ladder. This is what you can do with your old dresser. And it's just, like, mind-boggling, you know, because I, I would never have thought of all this stuff. But, um... So it, does it open and have a mirror and stuff? Yeah. It's a usable thing. We get our neighbors talk to it. Well, you know, there's always places like Habitat for Humanity. They wouldn't take it. They wouldn't take it? Because they said it was a lot. Hey, look at that. Can I get some grapes? Yeah, that's a little bit touching a lot. Oh, really? Off. But feel free. <laughs> but there's, feel there's free. There's no warranty on the grapes. However, the bags do have a lifetime warranty. If you ever have any trouble, send it back to us. And we'll replace it straight across. It's a water resistant nylon fabric. It's very durable. We've got some that are about seven years old. Been doing it for continuous use since they were made. Wow. They still look about like that. Good fabric. Polyester microfiber on the outside, so even though it's soft, it's real strong. Good zipper. Cool. It's meant to replace daily use of Ziploc bags. So four packs are 20 bucks. We got three different color schemes available, and uh, that's that. They wash up real good in the laundry, dishwasher, even wash by hand. Just however you're already doing things. It's meant to just fit into your life. And, just reduce waste and give you something pretty to look at. Cool. Alright, well thank you. No problem. Thanks for stopping by. Happy Earth Day weekend. You too, man. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? Pretty good. Year and How are you? Oh, it's another Marissa. Great. Great. Happy birthday weekend. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. What do you guys do here? Well, it's um, the first trailer. Who well, we has been approved for the first trailer? What's the charter school mean? Well, it just means, uh, I don't know the answer to that question, the charter school. Oh, come on. That's the easiest question. Well, I can tell you what our school does. Okay. Um, it's a project-based experiential learning model um, that's pretty much trying to change the paradigm of education so that it's based for kids to learn things that are relevant for today. So we have an entrepreneurial-based program, um, leadership, mindfulness, conscious eating, um, and I do exper experiential stuff, so expressive arts. And yeah, I saw those things there. They're all cool. there. But wow, it's engaging yeah. kids in a different way that uh, public schools can't really offer right now. So charter is like basically the ability to do it differently, but it's like still be free. Okay. Was it like part of the teachers union or whatever? Or? Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't know actually. Um, he's the owner. We open in the fall. So we've been approved and we're getting things going. We have enrollment already. It ends at the end of May. So, so where's your guys' charter school? It'll be up in North County area. We're just about to find a location. We have some places that we've scoped out. Oh, so you guys haven't even started the school yet? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. That's cool. I don't know what you're referring to as a curriculum. Yeah, what kind of, January of this year. What kind of like conscious eating things are you guys going to incorporate? Like um, try to feed them as much sugar as possible with milk exactly. and meat? Exactly. Um, the first five minutes of eating will be silent. So we're 
like being mindful that you're eating and that you're paying honor to the food that is in front of you. So uh, we'll model that for them at first, the teachers, about spending five minutes in silence before we begin talking and then having um, papers on the table for mindful conversation so that we're not just talking about TV shows and if it doesn't matter. Basically trying to engage their brains in thinking about things that do matter, like emotions and relationships and what do we think of this? Um, so that's kind of the way that we're going and then the hot lunch or I called it hot lunch and I went to school, I don't know what they call it now, but when you pay for lunch at school, organic. Oh, cool, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's thinking about having it be vegetarian based, but not entirely sure if he wants to go that route yet. Doesn't want to force opinions onto people, certainly not. But also to have the meals that were offered in line with the values of school. So, and these kids that are no, 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 dude. Just checking it out. Yeah, yeah, just looking. Yeah, cool. Well, I saw, you know, all the cool little artwork, so I was just like drawing. Check them out. I mean, some of the kids were really nice. Like, we wanted to ask them how they wanted to feel when they were at school. It's cool. It's like. School should be fun, right? Like engaging for them, you know. But the problem, the problem is, like, the problem is, the problem is, all kids are different. Like eventually, there's gonna be like one kid, like where it's just like he's bored with it. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, these are cool. Wow, that one's cool. Alright, what was your name? Marissa. Matthew. Matthew, nice to meet you. Alright, happy Year's Day weekend. Happy Year's Day. I like your hat. Oh, thanks. Like your shoes. Thanks, they go mm -hmm. well. Hey, good. How you doing? This thing looks dangerous, holy cow. No way the thing is safe. Nice shirt. Oh, thank you. My brother's collected. He's got a pen over there. Oh, cool. Yeah. I've been hearing that on the radio, too. SD Roots. <laughs> yeah? I don't know if they're talking about the store or just like SD Roots. I'm not sure. I, but, I don't know. But it's, it's worth checking out. Cool. Where, where is it at? Uh, just right here? Over in the Cana Village. Where I'm going to pull out Oh, okay. Cool. And it's right across from the TP. It's like a GP, it's right across the water. Okay, cool. 
Well, have a good one, man. Happy Earth Day weekend. I know a guy. Uh, no, 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 I'm not, no, no, I'm not going to turn my car into a